that. I also love food, and it's Foodie Friday. But that's not the only thing we're celebrating. Bastille Day, or the French National Day, is this Sunday as well. Yes. So we know some folks that have started celebrating a little early. We, oui, we. Oui. ABC 7's oui. Kristen Clark is at the French in Naples, where they are getting ready for a few fun events for Sunday. Uh, bonjour, Kristen. Oh, bonjour. Okay, well, wait till you see this. Things are about to get real hot in here. You ready, Vincenzo? I'm ready. All right. And woo, there it goes. <laughs> what a meal. You guys are the French in Naples. We have the French holiday coming up on Sunday, French National Day. So what are we making now? So we're going to make a very traditional uh, French uh, brasserie and bistro uh, dish, steak frites au poivre. So here we're making a cognac sauce. So we're just uh, taking some shallots, some garlic, some fresh thyme. You put in the cognac, and now I'm going to continue to make the sauce. So it goes very traditional with our New York strip here that we've uh, seared in a cast iron pan, and we're going to serve it with frites, so cool. nice crispy fries. I'm going to let you keep working on this. This looks delicious. I'm going to walk over here to Jason because to celebrate this holiday, you guys have so many different events going on all weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. We do. It's a, a big weekend for the French with Bastille Day on Sunday. Uh, both Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, we have live music. Tomorrow we have brushes and brunch. We have a local painter, Jackie Bickford. She's going to lead uh, all the guests through a painting of the Eiffel Tower. Sunday, we have practice yoga coming in for yoga and brunch. And we have the French Alliance coming in for dinner that night as well to celebrate Bastille Day. So many fun celebrations going on. And we're going to get back over here to Vincenzo and see what he's doing over here because we have this dish cooking on the grill. Vincenzo, how is it going back here? So the dish, it's steak and fries, right? What's steak the French freeze. term for that? Steak frites, yeah. So it's real classic. I mean, this is very typical of uh, French bistro, French brasserie. You know, the cuisine of Europe is extremely simple. Um, and so in France, when in France, you know, you want to have steak frites. So here we have a nice little shoestring uh, frite. And then we have our New York strip here that we've seared. I'll bring it over. All right. And our is it cast all ready iron. To go? Put that on the plate. Well, Jen and Greg. We have got another meal here ready to go for you guys in honor of French National Day on Sunday. We're going to send it back for now. Doesn't that look good? Mm. <laughs> oh, c'est très bien. Looks, looks fantastic, doesn't it? Oui, oui, oui. It oh looks, my uh, gosh. It, it looks fantastic. Yes. <laughs> yes please. It looks wonderful. Oh no, my I like gosh. it. I, I think I, I love French food. I, I do too. It's delicious. All right. Thank you so much, Kristen. You speak pretty well in French. I was a French exchange student, lived in Paris for a year. But you know, you lose it when you, when you come back. and You lose a lot of things in life. You lose it. The older we get, we lose a lot. It's not just Except your, for weight. It's we not just your that. French, Jen. Um, <laughs> count, even when you count, you sound really good in French. It's a, Ooh, uno, trois. Do, or, yeah. You just <laughs> Spanish. Un, deux, trois. Un, deux, trois. Un, quatre, deux, cinq, six, sept, huit, neuf, dix. Ooh, sounds romantic. <laughs> Um, if you have an idea that we can showcase here on More Explorers, it's really easy. Uh, ABC7 Morning at abc-7.com is probably the worst way to do it. But if you want to do it a good way, <laughs> Facebook is always the quickest way. Uh, so many of you already have Facebook accounts. You can just drop us a line. Whatever you got going on, we're going to send Kristen up to you. It doesn't matter what's going on. We're going to send Kristen to you. If they can remember the email address, it's perfect. It comes right to us. But you and I even have a tough time remembering it. I, yeah, I, yeah. I would not think to use that email address. We're, we're working on it. All right. We'll see.